Paul Thomas Anderson fans rejoice. A new movie from the filmmaker behind There Will Be Blood, Inherent Vice, Boogie Nights, and more acclaimed films is returning to his San Fernando Valley roots to make a new movie set in the 1970s. The Hollywood Reporter has learned the untitled film will be centered on a high school student who is also a successful child actor. Anderson will write, direct, and produce the project. Sources say casting is underway to find the lead, and the project features a multitude of roles. It also could be ensemble in nature or have intersecting storylines. Sources to say Anderson's project is planning to go into production in February 2020. Representatives for Anderson declined to comment. Three of Anderson's previous films are also set in the San Fernando Valley, the northern stretch of LA where the filmmaker grew up. Those are 1997's Boogie Nights, starring Mark Wahlberg and Burt Reynolds. You are fired! What? You're fired! You're fired. Yes. 1999's Magnolia, whose cast includes Tom Cruise and Julianne Moore, among others. What did he say? Because I am not going to take care of him. What does he want? And 2002's Punch Drunk Love, featuring Adam Sandler, Emily Watson, and Philip Seymour Hoffman. I have a love in my life. It makes me stronger than anything you can imagine. Anderson's last film, 2017's period drama Phantom Thread, starring Daniel Day-Lewis and set in 1950s London, was the first time the filmmaker made a movie outside of the U.S. The film was nominated for six Oscars, winning for costume design. Are you sent here to ruin my evening and possibly my entire life? Stop it! For more on this story, head to th.com. Until next time, for The Hollywood Reporter News, I'm Tiffany Taylor.